Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So I finally decided to make uh, my entire luxury designer bag collection video. I made one um, when I just started the YouTube channel. It was like about nine months ago, eight months ago. It was one of my first videos, but uh, my collection dramatically changed. Um, I sold a couple bags, I bought much more, um, so I decided to split it into parts. Since majority of my bags are from Louis Vuitton, um, I decided to make part one of the video all about my Louis Vuitton bags. I'm gonna do it the same way as I did with SLGs. I'm gonna um, tell you the prices and what's currently available online, uh, what you can place in a cart, what you can call, uh, about what item you have to call for availability, and also they have third option, they notify me. Not sure what that means, but it means you cannot just buy it right away online. Okay, let's get started. So my first bag is going to be this cutie. By the way, they're all lying down on my bag right now. And I think it's about 20 Louis Vuitton bags. Oh my God. Okay, so my first bag, bag called... Again, forgive me for pronunciation, Beauté Chapeau Souple. I believe when I got it, it wasn't that easy to get it in the stores or online, but I think it's got easier. Um, so it's a very nice bag. Uh, what I liked about this bag that uh, Vachetta leather, which was, I, I believe it's already treated and it's a little bit darker. Not sure about treated uh, though, but it's it's slightly darker. It came already a little bit darkened. It has a little pocket here. It has this cute charm, back charm. And if you really want to, you probably can put your name there. I'm not going to do that. That... Um, charm is removable also it has a little locket here and the hardware is very shiny i don't know if you can tell but it's it's very shiny on this back so that's how it looks inside it has a microfiber lining it has one pocket here where i keep the keys from the lock and this bag was made in France. I know it's important for some people. It's not for me. It is a statement bag. Enjoyed it a lot this summer. And I will be showing bags probably on me. Forgive my outfit if my <laughs> it's my home outfit. That's how it looks on me. And um I'm 5'8", again, for reference. And again, strap is adjustable. You can adjust it to your height. I see a lot of people wearing it like this. And of course, you can wear it cross body, which I love to do, and be hands free. Okay, so this bag currently is available online and you can buy it right away. It says place in cart. Second one, yeah, and I bought it from um, Saks Fifth Avenue, Louis Department, um, Louis Vuitton Department, yeah. Next bag is my Montagny MM. It has short detachable strap um it's not adjustable it's pretty short strap um i see it as a more elegant bag it's perfect for work um what i like about this bag a lot that those uh, uh handles go they attached from inside and you can hide them here and wear it uh, on the shoulder 
So it has this little, um, how you call it? Key pochette. It has two big department here, departments here. It has one pocket here, two pockets here. The fabric is um, purplish. Lining is a little bit purplish microfiber, very soft. And it has um, this department, zip department here, which you can lock. This is, um, the locket right here and also you can close this bag here so I prefer to wear it on the crook of my arm just like that I tend to wear it more uh, in colder months and that's how it looks on me with the shoulder strap it's probably the best when you carrying it on your shoulder using shoulder rack you either just fold your like this your handles like this because otherwise they're gonna be on the way very nice bag I bought it pre-loved the price of this bag is $200-460 in, in this size. I bought it pre-loved and I believe I bought it for about $1,700. I don't remember what I bought it from. I think I bought it from Poshmark. Not from Fashion File for sure. I think I bought it from Poshmark. And um, so I saved quite the money. It came in a very good condition. Aside from uh, which it had been uh, patinaed, um, nothing wrong with this bag. It came with receipt, with box, with um, dust bag. Um, it came in a brown box, so that tells me it was bought. And I, actually, it says and received that it was bought, like, I think in 2015. This bag actually currently available online. You can place in a card, order right away. And it comes in different sizes. Okay, moving on to another one. Neverfull GM. I have two Neverfulls. One in the mirror Ben and one in um, monogram but this one is uh, mon monogram it's customized with my initials and black and white stripes so price for this was much higher I believe I paid like around 1800 for this one and um, this bag I paid fourteen hundred. This this one in um, in the Mier band I bought it when it did not come with the pochette, um, uh, this kind of pochette in the bag. So this came without. They added pochette later. So this was my travel bag, work bag when I used to work everything bag i have organizer in this bag this one is from workout and uh, i use it constantly this is lining on this bag and it has one pocket um everybody familiar with this bag but i'm gonna go over anyway and you can close it like this. This is GM size. Both of my bags are GM size. I need the memory PM look good on me. That's how this looks on me open. I And I do like oversized bags. And when I wanna downsize it a little bit, I just pull the straps in. And then it looks much smaller and you even can take your uh, insert out when you make it smaller smaller okay so it's available online you can buy it right away 
it's 1400 as I say, GM size, and you can place it in a cart. This one came with Pachette. I also uh, monogrammed it, I mean, customized it. This is the same size GM, but personalized and in monogram. You also can make it smaller. This is only personalized bag I have from Louis Vuitton. I have also insert here, but in different color from the same company. But I originally prefer court. I didn't buy it for this bag. I bought it for my Goyard and you can use the same bag, uh, the same insert for Goyard and for a Louis Vuitton GM. Uh, because look at this, I'm going to show you insert from my Louis Vuitton Daniel Ben Red, which I bought specifically for Louis Vuitton. So it literally almost the same size. Well, it's the same company. So if you have uh, Louis Vuitton GM um, and you have uh, Goyard, San Luis Goyard, you can use one insert for both. Okay, so where was I? So this monogram is also so far available online. You can place it in a cart, and these days it comes with a pochette. And non-personalized, it's $1,400. Next, Speedy Bandelier 25. Is this cutie right here? I used to have Speedy 25 very long time ago, not Bandelier. Again, I sold it, um, and uh, I didn't regret that I sold that one because I like it more with a strap. So this is um, in monogram, and I have a little charm here. It has detachable, adjustable strap. I like when they're detachable and adjustable because you can switch straps around and personalize it a little bit and just play around with the straps. how it looks on me. This I prefer to wear on the shoulder or cross body. I rarely wear it like this, I don't know why. And I also have an insert here. This insert from Samorga. And this bag it's also available online. You can place it in a cart right now and buy it. It prices $1,430, but I bought it on the secondary market. Again, don't remember where. I bought it uh, maybe literally only $100 less because bag was li literally new. The girl was selling it, it I, I think she wore it like a couple times. Um, and, um, but I still saved a couple bucks. And um, you can even now tell that uh, handles are still light. And it, it came in perfect condition. So, so I saved on tax and I saved a little bit on, on the price. Well, this bag doesn't need an introduction, right? It's like everybody knows it, everybody loves it. Actually, not everybody loves it. I know people who can stand speedy for some reason, but it's um, iconic bag. And I'm happy it's back in my life with uh, update, an updated version. Difference, by the way, from old speedy also, that these things are puffy. They are puffy. They used to be very flat, now they're puffy. Okay, did I mention that it's available online? Yeah, it says place in the cart so far. 
Now, next one. Crochet accessories. I believe I uh, went over this in my um, SLGs video also, but since I use it as SLG and as a bag a lot, so I decided to mention uh, it's in this video because not everybody interested in SLGs. I um, wear it as a bag a lot when I want to downsize it. And this uh, strap, by the way, it didn't come with this bag. This pochette came with a little leather strap. This I bought separately for $280. It's adjustable and it's very thin and it fits this bag perfectly. That's how it looks on me. I always wear it across the body. Um, never wear it like this. This bag is too small, in my opinion, to wear it just on the shoulder. So across the bar, uh, Across the body when I go shopping and I need my hands free. This bag, this bag is for $525 and it has a pocket here and this one was made, uh, where was it made? Also in France. I didn't tell you guys what other bags were made. This speedy bundle here made in USA and Montagny was made in USA and my uh, Never Fools Damiere bag was made in USA and this one was made in France. You cannot buy it online. It says call for availability. It's hard to find it in the stores. This piece is hard to find and on secondary market, it gets sold for a um, little markup. I've seen it um, for 600, for 700. So I'm very glad I have this little cutie. Okay, next one. And I bought it in a store. I bought it in a store in my local mall. Next and Palm Springs Backpack Mini. This one, also hoty, hard to find a bag. I bought it in um, my local mall in Louis Vuitton boutique. Um, so this one was uh, made, I believe in USA. I don't use it as a backpack ever. I use it as a um, shoulder or crossbody bag. Cutie patootie. I have a little pink charm here. Again, that's how it looks on my frame. Everybody complains about those zippers. Um, it is somehow hard to open easily. It's okay, I guess. It has a little loop here. You can put like a little scarf here. I saw people do that. This one is more durable because it has black leather. So I tend to wear it when the weather is not that great. And if it's raining, um, very cute bag. Again, unfortunately, it says call for availability. It, it was um, hard to get. When I saw it um, in my store, I just grabbed it because I knew it's gonna disappear and I wanted to have it. Okay, moving on. Palm Spring Backpack MM. Yes, I have another Palm Spring bag, but this this is the biggest size. So these, this Palm Springs come in mini, PM and MM. So I have mini and MM. This just, it's, it's gr look at these straps. They are the most comfortable straps ever. I, I love this backpack, love this backpack. I use it for travel. I use it when I just go somewhere and need my hands free and I have something heavy so i tend to take this with me i either wear it like this 
or just like this, depending on the situation. This is more stylish. That's how it looks on me. Also very durable because it doesn't have a machete. It has a black leather. It has pocket here. So zipper on the pocket, I have no problem with. So zipper here again is wonky. I think it's because of this design. Yeah, but when you have it on your back, it's actually benefit because if you cannot open it, nobody can open it and nobody gonna get inside of your bag. So this is a good part. Silver lighting in everything. Love this bag. And um, the price of this bag, oh, I forgot to tell you price of the mini, sorry. Price of the mini is $1,940. But again, it's, you cannot buy it online right now. You're lucky if you find it in a store. Um, this one, the price is $2,210. It's not available either. You have to call for availability. I bought it, I believe again, Poshmark, and I paid, I remember, $1,800. So I saved quite money, and it came in perfect condition. And it has black washable lining, satin lining inside, and it has a pocket here. Yeah, love, love, love this bag. Very practical, very durable, and you can wear it with, I mean, I wore it with the dresses, I wore it with jeans, I wore it with leggings, with basically everything. Okay, moving on. Paula's BB. Where are you, Paula's BB? Oh, this cutie right here has absolutely amazing soft microfiber lining. This one also made in, by the way, this made in US. This one also, yeah, made in US. So it has one little pocket here and it has magnetic pockets with magnetic uh, shoulder uh, closure here and another one here. When bag is made in France or Italy or Spain, it just says on, on the main tag below Louis Vuitton Paris, it says made in France, made in Italy or made in Spain. For some reason, bags made in USA it doesn't say here made in USA, it says nothing below the uh, Louis Vuitton Paris, but you will find another tag somewhere inside, sometimes hidden, like in here it's hidden in a pocket, which will have, it could be, it could be fabric tag, it could be leather tag, that's, it will say additionally made in USA, from imported materials. I don't know why it's different with USA bags, made in USA bags, but this bag I bought pre-loved. Um, and not in the best condition, but I knew that. It came with this stain, so, but I saved great deal on it. I bought this bag for 1400, I believe, but it, the price is $2,320. And if this thing doesn't bother me, but I could change those handles. And I have a quote actually, uh, Louis Vuitton can change those handles for $240. And essentially I would have new bag for $1,640 versus $2,320. So I, ha I think I, have a great deal on this. It is available online. You can place it in a cart. But that's how it looks me. Crossbody. And it's, the strap is not adjustable, but detachable. And you can wear it on the crook of your arm. Okay, moving on. My favorite, newest, bag, my favorite bag of the moment. I keep wearing it since I got it. I have stuff inside, 
my Noé. This is the biggest size, but it's called Noé. The smaller size is called, I think, Noé PM, or that's how it looks on me. I treated with uh, the, it's a lot of bocetta guys here. So I treated it with the apple guard and I have video on it. So, so far I don't have any stains. So I think that apple guard worked and I treated it right on camera. So if you didn't see that video and you're interested in how to protect your bocetta bags, I'm gonna link that video as well. The price is $1,590 and it's available online and other sizes are available online. Except, which brings me to another bag, Nano Noe. This one, unfortunately, by the way, I keep forgetting to tell you where it's made, right? I, I'm like going back and forth all the way on the bottom. It says that it's made in France. Okay, so that little Nano Noe, also made in France. Unfortunately, it's not available. You have call for availability and thanks to my essay, um, she, when they got it, she texted me right away. She texted me right away and says, listen, I didn't see that bag coming in since I work here. And she works there like, I don't know, for a few years. So she texted me the picture. I was installed on it. But when I went to order these bags, yeah, I bought it from Boutique, by the way. I, she still showed it to me. <laughs> Great essay, by the way. She knows what she's doing. Um, she showed it to me and in person it looked much, much cuter and I put it on me and I just couldn't resist this bag. It's, it's, it's adorable. It's adorable. It's very light, smooshy. It has non-detachable, non-adjustable strap. So that's where you have to be careful depending on your height, but I think it's, it could be longer, a little bit cross body, but I don't mind. Um, right on the shoulder, it looks perfect. And just the cutest, cutest, cutest bag. So happy I have it. And by the way, it's not that, okay, it's tiny bag, but it's not that crazy expensive. It's $1,100. Again, not available online at the moment. You have to call for availability. Next is bum bag. Yeah, this cutie. Very, very stylish bag. Love it a lot. It was $1,500. Unfortunately, you have to call for availability. You cannot buy it. It is quite hard to get, <clears throat> but it's possible. Well, technically it's a bum bag, which you're supposed to wear like this, but I never wear it like this. I either wear it as a shoulder bag just like this or like this. But the most way I love to wear it like this. It's front of me, so convenient. <clears throat> Again, zipper is the same zipper like on those palm. It has that lip. It has a lip also like tight, but it's okay. I can live with that. Love this bag and love to wear it like this a lot. So you put everything, it's very roomy for a bum bag. You put everything here and you go shopping. And you can, it could be crowded. You just put your hands here and you aren't worried about anything. Love, love, love this bag, love it. That's how it looks on me. It has a little loop here. You can put charm here or anything, whatever you want. It's inside it basically, one big space it has black lining it was made in France 
in the back we have a zipper where I usually keep my phone. Again, it can work like this too. I bought it also in my local boutique. Oh, the video is long. Next, one of my newest bags. My only bag from this collection. I do have a soldiers, but not the bags. This one. Giant monogram on the go bag. And it's actually in reverse. Reverse giant monogram. This bag has actually shoulder straps. I was contemplating to get this bag, but then I was like kind of on the fence. I never saw it in a person, so I didn't want to just ask my say, okay, let's order. And then I walked in in Bloomingdale's one day on um, in Manhattan, and it's just sitting there. So I grabbed it right away. Um, and it's $2,440. It's not available online. And it says notify me. Love this bag. It has a red lining, which it's okay, but I just don't understand why they did red lining. I would prefer probably beige, but I don't mind red. And it has um, one zipped pocket and two smaller pockets right on the zipped pocket right here. And this bag is made in USA from imported materials. Yes. You can close this bag. Yes. It makes it very nice travel bag. Or a tote bag basically anything and it's very structured and these shoulder straps are attached from inside so if you don't want to use them you just put it inside and nobody even gonna see and you just turn stuff around like this next bag is this Pachet Metis if you subscribe to me you know the story about this bag how i have to had to replace it and how i got it um one of my favorite bags that how it looks on me like to wear it like this or i consider it more of a serious bag mine was made in uh, United States. The price is one thousand eight hundred thirty dollars. Right now, it's not available in this monogram. It's available in the leathers, but in monogram reverse monogram, uh, in this original uh, style, it's not available. So you can request from your essay. But I believe it's maybe slightly easier to get it now than before. That's what I heard. Don't quote me on this. My another newest edition. This cutie right here. Oh my BB. I don't know why it took me so long to get it. This is the cutest bag ever. And I prefer it in Damier Den. Oh, that's how it looks inside. Pretty roomy for such a small bag. I have a pocket here it comes with um, this pochette with the keys inside and i put the locket here and it's actually shiny hardware it has a fit on the bottom and this one was made in the uh, united states and i bought it in a um, flagship store in new york on 57th street adore this bag again that's how it looks on me just how it looks on this body strap is not adjustable but detachable oh 
Okay, and right now, what it says, yeah, price is $1,230, and you can place it in a card. You can buy it right now if you want to. Moving on to Duomo Damier Eban. Next one is this one. This is basically only bag from my Louis Vuitton collection, which is not available for purchase anymore. It, I believe it was discontinued. You can find it on secondary market, but I couldn't find it online at all. Um, and it's very, very, I wore the bag so much. It's very practical messenger bag. The uh, strap is adjustable but not detachable and the way zipper works you can either close it like this or you can close it in the middle it's double-sided i like it when i close it in the middle that's how it looks on me i wear it also cross body very comfortable bag for a weather when you're afraid to wear your vachetta bags very and not only, not only for that weather, but very nice bag. Like most of them, yeah, I think all of them, yeah, a bit have uh, red linings. I have one pocket here and two pockets here. And this was made in France. Very practical. So um, when it was available, it, the price was $1,750, but there are a lot of them on a secondary market. I see them all the time. Couple bags left. This one, my only non-canvas bag from Louis Vuitton. I bought it because I wanted it going out red bag. This is in imprinter leather and it's called Feliz so whenever and it has this chain which is detachable which is bono for example I can detach this chain from here and put it on my Pochette accessories. Look at this. Isn't it awesome? And, um, but going back to Feliz, you can detach the strap and this becomes clutch and also good. It comes with those two inserts there. This is credit card insert. And this is like little, little pochette. And you can take it out and use them separately in your other bags. This also has a pocket right here. And I believe it was made in USA, was it? Yes, it was made in USA. So whenever I wanna go out and use a red bag, this is my go-to bag. I use it a lot in the summer, not even just going out, just with some dresses. Nice pop of color. This bag first, uh, when I was like looking online to tell you guys if it's available, I couldn't find it. So this apparently listed on Louis Vuitton website as a uh, SLG. So don't search for it under the bags, search it for SLG. And this bag comes in different leathers canvases mine is an imprinted leather in imprinted leather it it's $1,270 and in this particular color which is color series I think that's how you pronounce it it's not available online right now it says notify me but it's available in very in a different red which called scarlet it says place in the card. It's also available in um, marine rouge. It's a combination of navy printer and it has a like, it has a red piping some sort. 
it says place in a card and it's also available in black which is should be very popular it also says place in a card fortunately in this bright red color called cerise it's not available but I, I i've been seeing it in the stores moving on from felice did i say the price one thousand hundred seventy dollars i bought it in local mall in louis vuitton store obviously moving on um to almost done guys almost done this is my um beach bag this is the only bag i have um and i, I don't know does it consider a soldier or a bag so but unfortunately it's not available online it's from summer collection um i couldn't find it online in this color i found it only in that um jungle collection um that's how it came and price was 880 dollars so you can um wear it as a little bag right here you can wear it as a wristlet You can take this completely off. That's how it comes off. And use it as a cosmetic pouch. Or like I used it a lot, I would just use it as a catch-all for my beach, larger beach bags. Also, I bought additional strap, heavy strap, in this same color combination. And strap cost me almost the same amount as the pouch itself. So you attach it to this and it becomes something different. It becomes very kind of kind of how cool cool beach bag when you wanna put it across your body, even though it comes short, but I think this is a look, you know. I wore it this way also when I went on vacation. I bought it also in my uh, local mall in boutique and where it's made, it's made in France. It's made in France, price was $880. Moving on to my newest edition. Of course, I bought it pre-loved. I was chasing this clutch pouch, whatever it is, for so long. The minute it would come up on a fashion file, I would follow it, hoping it's gonna go disc get discounted. Either the minute it get discounted, even though Fashion File notifies you, somebody would buy it, or even it wouldn't even last until it gets discounted, somebody would buy it. Um, so, or it would be less than excellent condition. I usually buy stuff from Fashion File only in excellent condition amazing pouch with this absolutely amazing um master color lining it has a pocket here and it has a loop here i think it came out in 2007 i never bought anything from that collection and i regretted it so much i bought it for 620 dollars i believe and I think um, I paid up. I think it was much cheaper when it came out. But I'm, I'm so glad to have it. It's in excellent condition. And finally, I got my hands on it. Fortunately, of course, it's not available in Louis Vuitton anymore. It's basically vintage. But you can buy it on secondary market. But it either goes for... It, sometimes it goes for over $1,000. Or it's hard to find for reasonable price. But Fashion File had a lot of them. So if you're interested, I would stalk Fashion File and just, but be quick. Okay, my last Louis Vuitton bag. It's called Keep All 45, size 45. It's my travel bag. It came... Um, 
it came with tag and it was already imprinted with somebody else's initials but it was not golden print it just embossed and i talked to my sa and they were able to stamp it over that initials with this so i don't know if you can tell if it's all the initials were ever there but they put my initials here and to cover actually they put my initials above initials all the initials were here and we covered them with these flowers and so it's literally impossible to see that something else was there yes i could buy of course new tag but i, I like this one and it's the same it's patina the same way it just it was no need and um i bought this bag pre-loved it was not in perfect condition and had the watermarks but it's a travel bag i know i'm gonna stay in it and i saved great money on it um right now i believe keep all bundle year in a monogram 45 is uh one thousand eight hundred dollars i bought this bag of ebay yes i did risk but i kind of did my homework and researched the seller and had perfect reviews and um I bought it for $900, but eBay had some kind of promotion. They give you something of, so I paid even $100 less. So I ended up paying $800 for $1,800 bag made in France. So this is my weekender, or if I travel on the plane, this is my carry on. I like to be stylish in airports. And I see people, by the way, wearing it around the city. I don't know what they're carrying there, but people wearing it as a gym bag. Okay, this is it. This is my uh, Louis Vuitton um, collection. It's part one of my entire luxury designer bags collection video. And uh, I think, I believe it's, I don't know. Was it like around 20 bags? Oh my God, yeah, that's a lot. Well, that's some, for some people, it's not a lot. For me, it's a lot. Let me know if you like my collection. If you have any comments, please post my comments. Don't forget, it's only part one of my whole luxury designer bag videos. Second part will be coming um, next week and it's gonna, um, we'll be talking about all my other designer bags luxury designer bags thank you for watching don't forget to press the subscribe button if you didn't do so yet um also click that bell uh it will notify you every time i post my videos and if you like my video please press like also go on my instagram i've been posting a lot there in the stories on, on the feed uh, the handle of my instagram in my um channel header Okay then, I will see you another time. Bye.